Hey guys, uh, how are you all? Uh, so welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have invited uh, Kit uh, Kumar Yadav. So he is currently working as a postdoctoral research associate at uh, Harvard uh, Medical School. So it's been my pleasure to invite him. It's uh, one of the top uh, uh, university in the world. So Ankit Kumar did his uh, B Tech from IIT uh, Roorkee, then M Tech from IIT Guwahati, and then PhD from IIT Bombay. So like it's like very beautiful journey in his life uh, so to start uh, with uh, today's video uh, let ankit introduce himself his background and his journey uh, like from pre tech to m tech then phd then to post doctorate so ankit uh, the floor is yours hi thank you for inviting me for this talk uh, i come from a small village in the district of balia in the eastern up and i was born there and then my family moved to lucknow and i did my schooling from city montessori school which is one of the best schools in the country it even has a guinness book world record for having the maximum number of students and i did my schooling there i was a topper there then i cleared my je exam and i joined iit roorkee for my btech in civil engineering and when i was doing my btech i was kind of self exploring also like what to do in career because career and relationships are the two key aspects of a human life so i was yes. more or less kind of self exploring and uh, gradually i came to realize that oh corporate job is not for me i don't want to end up as a corporate slave all my life doing coding or whatever either you do coding or I, either you go in some management stuff both are just for profit maximization which i was not kind of motivated towards so and yeah there was some like parental pressure also for going for ias and all those things you know like people from up and bihar they are mostly after the thing yes yes so that was also there but i was also like oh, that this is not my cup of tea and then i wanted more time and that's why i started exploring what are the alternate opportunities for me and one day like i was in a room of my friend and like he was watching some, some video about iit guwahati and then i was like oh this campus is looks fascinating and it's a beautiful like a portrayal of nature so i just applied there and i went for my masters and during my masters like at the end of uh, i think the third semester i was kind of in the mood of doing research all my life because i was getting much interested in exploring new things and learning about new aspects uh, contributing towards something novel and which is more applicable towards societal upliftment as well so then i contacted professors and then i kind of talked with them what should i do where to do my phd so they suggested that you have two options either you can go abroad or you can do in in india uh, i i was kind of susceptible like I, i didn't want to go abroad because whatever i'll do research there it will not be useful for my country yes. so i started looking opportunities in india it, it was easy for me like to go abroad as well but i was like okay let's do something in india which is more useful for indian society and indian like commuters i since my specialization is in transportation i feel it like more practical than the other disciplines like uh, if you see like there are many disciplines like water resources in civil engineering water resources structures and all these things but transportation is one thing which i felt very practical about like i can see people dying on the roads and i wanted i was not okay with it i was like if engineering and technology is doing so much wonders in every domain why not like use it for our for the good of people who exactly. are dying on the road so that's why i did my phd in road safety and my thesis was about uh, the influence of alcohol on driver behavior so like drunk driving incidences are huge even some studies say that like it's 20 to 30% and often many of them are not reported so I, I did my PhD in that, and then I completed within like three years and nine months with about fifteen publications. Oh. And then, yeah, and and yeah, I, I gave talks in various international conferences. Like uh, I I came to US in two thousand twenty for a conference, and in between my PhD, I spent three months in Japan also for uh, attending a program on sustainable transportation infrastructure. So last year in April, I defended my PhD, and then I started like exploring for like better opportunities. Okay. What should I do? And yeah, I started applying for postdocs. I applied to Harvard. I applied. I think I applied to more than fifteen universities, and, yeah. and then I got about five offers. And yeah, I I selected Harvard of, of course because of its prestige and the infrastructure, 
and also the opportunities that it provides to people. So, so, so yeah, that's why I'm here. Yeah. So it's been how many months or years uh, in Harvard uh, Medical? Ah, I I I came in March. It's been two months, more than two months. 